When your project is complete, iMovie offers several options for finalizing the movie. One of these is to export it. Now, this is a useful choice because it simply saves the video to your computer as a movie file. And this is useful because then you can do anything you want with it. You can email it to someone. You can save it to the cloud, to some place like YouTube. You could burn a DVD. Lots of different options for things you can do. So we're going to look at how you export a movie. To start, go to the top of your uh, iMovie window and click on Share. Then click Export Movie. Now on the screen that comes up, you're going to be you're going to see the quality options that you're given for your particular project. Now this is limited by the quality of video that was used in actually creating the project. If you're using an HD video camera, you're going to be able to save your project in HD format. If not, it's going to be something more along the lines of large, will be as big as you can do. There's good and bad points to that. An HD video format is great, you get nice crisp pictures, um, however it doesn't work well on all devices. It's also a really huge file size. As you go farther up on these choices, you, your file sizes get smaller, the quality gets less, but the file sizes get smaller, and the number of devices that it'll work on properly tends to increase. Medium right here will work on just about any kind of device. Um, that's a fairly typical file size. Uh, mobile is the smallest file size, so if you just want to email a quick video to someone or something like that, you can save it as a mobile format, and that'll be the smallest file and be more likely to go through email. So we're going to do that for right now. Actually, we're going to go with medium. Let's do that. And I'm going to give it a name, and we'll call it um, Great Movie. And it's going to save it by default in my documents. You can change locations easily enough if you'd like. You can get more options by clicking the little drop down right here, and you can see all your files and so on. But we're going to just for right now. And actually, I'm going to change this. I'm going to save it to my desktop just for ease of finding it. And I'm going to click Export. And what happens is iMovie will take just a few minutes to combine all the elements of the project and to make the final movie. And we'll come back and see it as soon as we're as soon as it's done doing that. Okay, so our video has finished rendering. I'm going to minimize the iMovie window. And here's the file that it created on the desktop. And now that file be open to be viewed in QuickTime. I can again I can save it in all kinds of different formats. I can put it on a DVD. I can do all kinds of things, but now it's actually ready to play in its finalized format. There you go. That in a nutshell is how you export a video that was created in iMovie 11.